you bring me McDonald's? Yeah, I got McDonald's for you, son. Here you go. Psych. Some support. We're gonna do a little tour of his uh, toolbox here. I know you guys have been wanting to see it, so uh, let's. Uh, without further ado, let's. What what's what's up, man? What's up? What's up? This this is my maximizer I've had for like a little more than a year, and uh, I mean I've filled it up with tools along the way, mostly Mac tools, but a lot of Snap-on stuff. Uh, you know, like all my sockets, my extensions, and whatnots, impact stuff. Oh, nice. Um, right now it's kind of a mess, but you know, we be busy at work and, you know. I cl cleaned it the other day, which is a good thing, you know, it would be really dirty right now, uh, showing you guys, but yeah, I just cleaned it with my with quick detailing. Nice. It seems nice, real, real easy to be honest. A lot of people might think that, since it's white, it'll get dirty, but I mean, I kind of just sometimes just grab my stuff with the rag and open it like that, you know. I try to take care of it. Nice, yeah, nice. Let's see what you got up top here, so. Uh, just stuff that I use all the time, so like my impact gun, all of my impact sockets over there. Very nice. Um, and then obviously regular like 3 8 sockets, a quarter inch extensions wrenches that i'm always using so right now they're like all over the place nice those are the mac precision torques and i see you got the snap-on sockets and uh it, extensions yeah my sockets definitely uh i want it to be snap-on okay nice nice so they they they, so they are i think they grip better than other sockets for sure yeah no that's all good so, yeah. See, you got a little Milwaukee charger here. Yeah, that's for my for my uh, Milwaukee batteries. Nice. It's hooked up over there. You got. Oh, you see, we got the we got the power bank right here. Okay, and I also got power uh, over here too. Outside too, so you know if, if we want to lock it, lock it up. Uh, you know, it's still be locked, and then I could charge stuff out here if I want to. Very nice. There it is. Very nice. You got your JBL speaker here for some music. Oh, yeah. We've been playing some jams working, you know. Very nice. And uh, what are the pry bars there? Those are... Uh, these are... Yeah, some of these are pry bars. Okay. We've got this big old... Oh, big old yeah. Right here. Very um, nice. It's in there and then some screwdrivers. Okay. Mostly Phillips and just flatheads. A little prelude over there? Oh, yep. Yeah, you got the prelude. Oh, S2000. Yeah, that prelude and the S2000. Very yeah. nice. Yeah. Some cool decals up there. Cool, cool. The calendar. <laughs> yeah. 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 April. Yeah. All right. Let's see what's in the drawers. Oh. Okay. Okay. More wrenches. Yeah, nothing crazy, you know. It's just but stuff that I use all the time, like this. My ratchets. Oh, okay. Snap on. It's the first one I got. Very nice. Yeah. Big old one right here. Standard. Uh. Wrenches. Nice and precision torque. Some other, I think I use this just for like, uh, for, just the, for brake lines. Yeah. 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 Some more Pittsburgh. Some of the Pittsburgh wrenches that I've had for like three years still work. Hell good. Nice. Yeah. Very nice. Uh, some, right here. some extensions. Okay, okay. Some of these I use sometimes. Oh, the blue point. The blue point three. Back. Okay, okay. Very nice. Oh, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. Um, I think right here I just got a bunch of junk, honestly. It's not junk, but just like stuff. I don't know. I have like some extensions in here. Uh, I'll come in here to grab this tool. Trim tool. Um, this. Blow gun. Just freaking gasket maker. And stuff like that. Feeler gauges. Yeah, just kind of other stuff like that that I wouldn't put in the other boxes or right in, in the other drawers some decals um, stickers whatever crack tablet yeah, yeah. This, I don't use it so. yeah <laughs> yep oh and then here we got the uh, yeah. yep there it is a little dark caliper put it in there. pretty cool that's pretty much it with the, there just, just kind of stuff that I like want to keep in the box or just like, you know, like I got this rooster ring from Ford Piston Eog or this KS-Tune little tap and die. Um, 
Stuff like that. Oh, just random stuff. I see. Okay. Yeah. On to the next here. one. I'll be going in here a lot because obviously I've got my impact driver. I use that a lot. This is probably my second favorite tool. <laughs> really? Yeah. Yeah, this one. Yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> Packs of punch, to be honest. And it's got a nice small size to it. Yeah, yeah. And then you can obviously I have the bigger battery on it. You can get a you can put the smaller one on it. Right. Which is more little. Okay. Yeah. Then, the Mac tools um uh, fit set. Nice. Big set. I use these a lot right here. Okay, okay. And then just Torx Phillips. Very nice. And, uh, wow, what was the there Green was there's some, the some of them that I don't use. I don't know. It says Posi Drive. Oh, I never use those. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. Posi Drive. Effect. I don't know. They're like smaller. Yeah. And I, I never use these. Though. Okay. What's in this case back there? I don't use this either, honestly. Really? Ugh. Honestly, what is this? The RBRT? Yeah, it is. Oh yeah, an RBRT set here. Yep. This is for. Hey, chill, 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 chill. We're gonna censor that. Yeah, we're gonna censor all that out. <laughs> yeah, but these are the RBRT ones. Honestly, <clears throat> I don't use these for sale. For sale. Okay, if you guys want them, shoot me a message. That's our give you guys a price. Yeah, for sale. For okay. sale. I don't I don't use it. Let's get that part number though. Oh, yeah. Because I know we always kind of slack on the part number. Look, there is the part number. It's, it's bigger right here, look. See right there, part number. For sale. All right. What's next? We got a, another set. This a lot, oh. But this one right here. This is the, what does it say? 123 piece Mac grip ratcheting. Ratchety. There's the part number. This one, awesome. 123 pieces. It comes with this ratcheting one. So you switch it right here. It comes with a ton of different bits, security bits, torque bits. Oh, nice. Bone, flatheads, whatever, anything you need. It's in here. It's in this little box right here. It gets the job done. I got this adapter, so when I want to put one of these on and put it in here, it'll lock it so it won't come out. Very and nice. And I can put it on there. Good to go. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, Love I it. I really like this. This right here. Awesome. To be honest. Uh, some other adapters in there. And then this, this is just like a... Nice T-handle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Two sides right here. Yeah. And then over here. Uh, what is this? I think it's the... Oh, yeah, the thin walls. I don't always use them, but when, when you need them, you know... Kind of sometimes you need a thin wall for taking off some wheels. They're right here. Came with an extension too, which is awesome. This is the Mac Tool set. Six piece, half inch drive. Very nice. Made in wall. USA too, guys. That's right, yeah. And then right here, I just got a bunch of just random stuff in there, just extensions and whatnot. Wheel locks, wheel lock keys. Oh, no, the spine keys, wheel keys, wheel spine locks. keys. Honda. Yeah, Honda tool, and Honda then some cooler. other sockets nice. and. and extensions that I use sometimes in there. Okay, cool, love it, man. I'll be going in here for... Pliers? Usually these are right here, kind of yeah. more tucked nice and neat, but I'm busy, so I just kind of just put them there and just throw them in there, but all our plier set, um, pretty much the ones right here are the ones I use the most. This snap-on snap -on ones, yeah. snap-on, but then a lot of the Mac Tools ones. Yep, I got I the use, same ones, man, in green. Hoses and stuff like that. Right, which um, I will say, though, with this one, you got to be careful. I find myself sometimes ripping the hose with those. Uh, yeah, something, yeah, you do got to yeah, be careful. Yeah, that's if something it, I noticed. If it isn't that fit, though, kind of just wiggle a little yeah. bit. Yeah. It helps, it helps with this. There's other tools, but I like using that. Right, right. Um, you got multimeter over here? Uh, yeah, multimeter, tape, measuring tape. I use these. Oh, man. Um, yeah, this is for like wheel studs. Yeah, uh, lug bolts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. You want to hold the wheel? Yep, on the uh, European ones. Yeah. 
So very nice, very nice. Yep. And oil filter wrenches. Oh yeah, yep. Filter wrenches. Okay, okay. I got this with this together. This came together. Yep, all came with a bag. I remember I that think, promo. Uh, it also came with this, I think. Yeah. Yep, it did. It, it was a big with... promo. I remember that. Yeah, that was very well worth it. It was. First tool set to the box. Yep. Oh, what do we got in here? I More have this set. Stuff. I usually come in here to get this that I keep in here, and then a hammer, my mallets. Um, this is just other bigger Blue drawer for other stuff that doesn't fit in the top. That I, usually that I won't use all the time. Right. But I do come in here a lot just to grab my the air gauge, and then this. Right. So said the blue point. Yep, yep, nice blue point. Gives you a little socket torques, e torques. Lot. Oh, yeah, I use this set. This is the set I have, identical set oh, yeah. to this. It works great. I love it. It is. A lot of, a lot of stuff there. Then we got, oh, yeah. what is this, a Mac code, little quick code reader over here? Yeah, this is pretty old. This is like. My, uh, my mom actually gave this to me. Oh, wow. She uh, bought this way back in like 2000 something. Dang, uh, she had a Mac code dealer around, I guess. It was my uncle's mechanic. So. Oh, okay. But she bought it. She bought it. Oh, so it's know. probably she's, dealer she, she's from had my it uncle. For a while. Yeah. She said, I mean, one day I grabbed it and she's like, hey, don't lose that. That's expensive. And I was like, yeah, I know. <laughs> Back then it was probably pretty expensive and yesterday's money. Yeah. Um, but she gave it to me since I, I'm obviously working on cars all the time now. So right. That's cool. Oh, what is this? I just got this not too long ago. Cool, it's a little digital torque reader, refurbished and calibrated. Yeah. I'm sure, you got a good deal on this thing. Yeah, I got a good deal on this. Shout yeah. out to Danny and Leo on those. Yeah, this is a uh, yeah, it's tech angle too. Okay, yeah, okay. So tech angle, five to hundred foot pounds. Oh, perfect. D8, so yeah, it's all you need right there for your Honda. Cool, a little bit of Healy coils over there I saw. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, I use this. Um, this is just parts. Part stuff. Uh, my other Fowler tool set. Oh right? yeah, gotta like those Fowler Don't precision these, well, tools. Well, cool. Okay, okay. And then the, the other set right there, I think, what is this? Here, let's I take a look what, at yeah, it. I forgot the micrometer set, yeah. Oh, let's see those micrometers, I'm curious. <laughs> I remember, shout out to Justin. He ordered these in for you. Yeah. Dude, brand new. Just chilling. Yeah. I use them. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're honest, in the bag. I freaking, yeah. That is I will cool. I'll be using them when I experiment with other stuff later on. Very nice. You got just more parts, plastic gauge, all sorts of stuff. Oh, the freaking. Your harmonic balancer, the one that yeah. broke. Yeah. Guys, this was all done and cleaned up and looks new. This usually like these are look gross and black and ugly. And this was cleaned up by the machine shop and I freaking broke it. Oh no. And maybe I could have ran it like that, but it would have been a little bit out of, out of balance. So what'd you do? Did you get a new one? Just got another one that I have at home. Oh, perfect. Yeah, you guys follow Cesar. He's got two preludes and a whole bunch of parts. They'll be coming together. Got the, yeah. Yeah, something like this right here that's gonna go in the car. Yep. Ground control set. Very yeah, nice. Put together. I think I'm missing a, a nut to put the uh, top hat on. Oh. Yeah, I might actually just get like different top hats for it. Just shorten it. Okay. Yeah. Is that the top hat on the for the original? This is what I'm using. Oh, okay. Yeah. But I might want to get a different one just for it to be lower. Right, right. Very nice. Is that a Bilstein? No, no, it's a Coney. <laughs> it's a Coney. And then that's pretty it's pretty much it. This is just stuff that I, you know, new parts and just other. Yeah, this is. Uh, I use that to. A ring. This was like yeah, this is a ring compressor right here. This is pretty cool, guys. This is precise for the exact piston. Yeah, yeah. Size. They just put it on there, push it in, and it goes in real nice. And it and doesn't. You don't have to clamp it or anything. Nope. That's pretty neat. Yeah. Tech 
tapered. I mean, I don't think you could tell it, but it, yeah, it's tapered. Very nice. Pretty cool, Cesar. Thank you for showing us your setup here. Yeah. Um, so yeah, guys, as y'all saw, Carlos didn't bring him breakfast. Off. So, oh yeah, it's paid off right here. That's that's awesome. Yeah. Hell yeah, man. All right, well, we're doing a tour of your tools. <laughs> Good old. <laughs> <laughs>